Hiya! Motherfucker, would you stop doing this shit? Oh, oh, it's you. Hey, how's it going, homie? Damn. Yeah, hey, uh, you seem incredible lately. Yeah, Trevor Phillips, but I doubt if you want a picture of him. Oh, wait, 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 wasn't he uh, in, in the, the men's room? Nah, nah. Oh, shit, I gotta... This is unbelievable. Ah, crap, that hurt. Man, you're not gonna believe this. They want to do a reality series about me. Yeah, it's true, man. I'm gonna be big. I'm gonna be huge, right? It's all about the incredibly glamorous life I lead. Huh? Good. Yeah, boy. Oh, yeah, boy. Yeah, except, you know, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna need somebody else to take some shots for me. Nah, no, I'm cool on that, dog. Oh, come on, dude. Come on, homie. All right, look, this, if you get a chance, right? I mean, there's no rush, okay? Oh, and what I'll do is I'll send you a list of names and some links so you can see who they are, right? Yeah, well, whatever, man. All right. Yeah. Hey, you know, and I promise you, fame won't change me one bit. Yeah, I was afraid you would say that. Ah! Oh! Ah! I'm good! I'm good! I'm okay! Ah, everything's good! Ah. Beverly's boy? Shit, I guess I am, huh? They're round back. Heavy security. I'd take a photo from the roof if I was you. Okay, I gotta go. This conversation uh, never happened. Yeah, I got yeah, you, I homie. It's good. Totally <laughs> I have sticky cowboy, mindless passion, purple plunder, endless panic, whatever you want. Marvelous. I'll take it all. <laughs> Okay. I am on holiday. I mean, apart from a few photo shoots with orphans and cripples, but like, I could do that in a coma. They really are the same the whole world round, you know? Okay, give me a second, eh? So like, back in England, my help would like totally do this for me, but they're like super scared of being arrested and totally banged by scary dudes in US jail, yeah? So like, so ghastly. It's just, it's such a total drag. I mean, the UK taxpayer gives them money to protect me and be my servant, so they should just, like, do what I say. Even if it's, like, lick my shoe or buy me drugs or, like, perform a sex act on my dog, you know? The taxpayer should totally get their money's worth, right? I mean, back when we had an empire, the king could, like, chop people's heads off and stuff, and that was so much better. I mean, the queen is like my granny. You know, it takes hundreds of years of inbreeding to get recessed chin, buck teeth, and snout like nose like mine. I mean, I'm a rare breed. I should be, like, cherished and stuff. Okay, here you go. This should chill you the fuck out. Oh, well, one of you eggs, please pay this poor man. Really, the Secret Service has gone down the pan. Oh, thank you. Fantastic. I really enjoy meeting the underclass. I'm so relatable in that way. Highness puns? <laughs> I am gonna be rich! Don't you mean we? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mikasa, Tukasa, you know. I I'll catch you later. I need to get this to print. Hey, yo, what's going on? Our friend Poppy Mitchell has just been spotted in a high speed chase with the cops! Like, like right now, bro! Apparently, she's wasted! Get after them! See if you can snag a shot of her getting busted! I guess that's her!
get myself into this. So I take it I can count on your attendance, friend. Huh? At the smoke-in. We're what? Yeah, we're gonna bring down the government by smoking weed together in a public place. It's very effective. I'm prepared to be a martyr, friend. Are you? Shit, if being a martyr means to smoke good weed, for sure. Would you like a little warm-up? You know, before you go and collect the supplies? Before I what? You know. Get the supplies. Can't have a smoke in without smoke. You know, cerebral stuff that's gonna get the people up off their feet protesting. Man, I don't know. It sounds kind of bullshit to me. We're gonna crush them with our resolve. Here. <clears throat> have a little taste of that. Hmm. <clears throat> <clears throat> Just a mellow, sophisticated high. Man, it seems a little dry. Can't you see the aliens? Man, what else are you taking? Man, this shit is garbage. Anyway, just get the stuff. It's a revolution, and then call me. Crazy motherfucker. San Andreas needs you. I I'll touch you. There he is, my number one player. You ain't cleaned yourself up yet, Tanya? What the fuck is wrong with you? You said it was all good on the phone the other day. I, I was, and you know, I did. I, I was clean. That's why you didn't really see me around for a bit, but JB, man, the smoking is real bad. Re real bad. I had a few days. But you ain't clean now. Exactly, okay? And now your ass gonna lose every fucking thing unless I help you, right? <laughs> I heard this shit before. JB ain't doing so good. JB ain't well. JB's your cousin. He ain't my fucking cousin. Look, your mama smoked, nigga. You know what it's like. Don't you have a heart? I don't have much of a heart. But by doing this, I don't have much of a brain either. I love you, Franklin. I mean, I don't know what you want me to say. JB, appreciate all you doing. Just one more job with me, and I promise this is gonna be the last time. It better be. Now bring your ass on. Come on. You wanna hit? Hell no. Nah. What happened to you, Tanya? You used to be a good girl. Even good girls need some sugar on their cereal. Days get long on the block. You know how it is. No, I don't know how it is. Why don't you get out the hood? Away from JB. I love that nigga, man, but he bad news. What, like you? Like Tanisha? Find me some rich lawyer or doctor? That ain't real. Maybe JB ain't going places, but you know who he is? If he went his ass to work, that'll be a start. I show me how good you got since last time. This is dispatch. Come in. We have an accident on Vespucci Boulevard. Over. We got it. 
Copy that, vehicle 29. Driver's badly injured. Phone box on the scene. Car needs moving to the nearest auto shop. 10-7. 10-7, 10-4. Tanya don't talk numbers, baby. Unless you talk in 420, then we got a date. Uh, 10-1, you're breaking up. Over and out. Man, ain't this like the fifth time? Ain't there any other fools out there you can guilt trip into working for no pay? You in the groove now, Franklin. And you and JB was homies before you had hair on your balls. Yeah, so you keep telling me. I still remember that time your grandpa caught you and JB slinging cigarettes. <laughs> Chased you all over South LS. <laughs> yeah, man, shit, that was a good hustle while it lasted. You still kicking it with that shit talk of Lamar? Oh, yeah, shit, I'm stuck with that fool forever. We didn't have much. But we did it right on Form Drive. Repair shop. I heard that. Over. I think there's one on Adams Apple Boulevard. I'd say you about earned a tow job of your own. Come on, Tanya. I told you you better than that. Don't get all high and mighty. You know different. You ain't afraid to use what you got to get paid? Man, what are you talking about? I heard about you rent boying on the side, selling yourself. What? That's what people are saying. You know Sharonda's cousin, Kiera's nephew, Deontay? Skinny kid with the big head? They call him golf club. No, I don't know Sharonda's cousin, nephew. He saw you with a rich white boy. I ain't judging. <laughs> I mean, we all got bills to pay. Man, that's so messed up, I don't even know where to start. Why are you making a big deal out of this? That should do it. Can you give me a ride back to the yard? Like I don't got nothing else better to do than drive your ass around. JB will make it up to you as soon as he gets back on his feet. Yeah, I heard that one before. Get some drink, get some smoke, get some good food, do it right. Me, you, JB, Tanisha, if you want. Now that ain't happening. Okay, you, me, JB, and that clown Lamar Davies, old school. If you ain't too busy rent boying, that is. <laughs> well, fuck you. Man, are you fucking kidding me? I should have never listened to that high-ass fool. Man, that ain't going nowhere by itself. Whoa, who changed my ringtone? Hey, look, man, that car in La Poeta is a fucking hoopty. The engine is fucking shot, man. I'm gonna grab the stash and get the fuck out of here. No, no, it could be a trap, and I need that car. The movement depends on it. You'll have to push it or something. Are you out of your damn mind? Hey, do it for your state. Do it for freedom. Do it for nature. Ignite the fight. You've been igniting the fight too motherfucking much, dawg.
please like me. I've said all there is to say. What? Man, get your ass down here. I'm outside with this junker you made me drag across town. Look, just leave it there. I can't come out now. The satellites. I mean, they're scanning our brains and tracking our heartbeats through the internet. Go now while you still can. Man, I'm wasting my fucking time. No, you're a hero, a green warrior. We're changing lives. This? The fool running around after. I found the truck you wanted. Oh, oh good, good. Uh, now hurry. I need it in Vespucci in the next couple of hours. Uh, and watch yourself. I hear the cops have been snooping around over there. Is that my pizza? Hell no, nah, fool, it's me. I'm here. Oh, well done. Hey, a true crusader for civil liberties. <laughs> uh, were you following? Man, your ass way too paranoid. Now look, man, won't you come down and check this? I got shit to do, man. Yeah, well, I'll send someone when I know it's clear, okay? Can't be too careful, and I'm dealing with some composting issues. <laughs> this is a bad burrito. Shit, what? And the jump still feels a bit gay to me. 
Hey, Bev! Oh, man, you fucking ruined the shot! You ruined the fucking shot! What the fuck you talking about? You ruined the fucking shot! It's a fucking reality show, and you ruined it, homie. Homie's got you them photos. Poppy Mitchell, the English princess, the others. Oh, right, man, you know? <laughs> Don't even remember, right? The whole thing is like... <laughs> but what about my money? We're shooting a show here, trying to work. Hello? Let's just, you know, have somebody call my agent or something. Man, fuck you. Whatever. Uh, back to one. Please, we're shooting something. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Now, where, now where were we? Uh, guys, do, do we have enough shots of me jumping around the corner? Uh, I think... <laughs> Okay, you know Redwood cigarettes? Sure, the cigarette that built America. They've rigged a jury to throw a class action lawsuit that would cover the treatment costs of thousands of emphysema sufferers. Now, there are four corrupt jurors on Redwood's books. I'll send you the details. Oh, and we only have a few hours to make them disappear. The court case is tomorrow morning. Is that all, dog? Shit, that's quite a favor. And that's quite a house you're living in. Get this done quickly, and I'll try to throw in a sweetener as well. Now, I'd advise picking up some long-range hardware to get this job done. You'll be helping a lot of people with this, Franklin, including anyone who might have a sizable investment in, say, uh, debonair cigarettes. Nah. Oh my god, he's got a gun! <gasps> Thank you. 
appreciate this shit. Damn, I ain't got much time left. Hell is done, homie. All of them. Very good. I'll be in touch. Ah, red truck, huh? Yeah, fuck it. Why not? Take me to my father, father, brother, uncle, Kiflam. Yo, peace, brother, brother. <laughs> Kiflam. Oh, Kiflam. really? Oh! I got you that stuff. Oh, great. Thank you. Where's your wife? Mrs. Thornhill, she's mm -hmm. not my wife. She's got a husband and two lovely kiddies at home. We met online. It's no nothing sexual. Where is she? Well, she's been trying to throw herself under celebs' wheels. <laughs> well, well, she can throw herself under my wheels anytime. Oh, <laughs> I knew you were funny, Jock. Yeah. I knew. I would like you. C can I have a hug? Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, hug, yeah. Uh, Come here. Come here. Uh, I've got a pr protruding hip. It's not a semi. Nigel! John! Huh? You won't believe what's happened! What? Only Al Dinapoli walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among us. us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Not me. I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad luck. And we were such fans. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruin everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. You see, like that little lockup I know. No problemo. Look, there he is. Oh, shit. It's that crazy English bitch again. Nigel, he remembers me. To the chariot. Jock, you drive. Quick, he's getting away. Come on, Jock, get in. He's taking a left turn down the high street, Jock. Do 
Did you ever imagine we might get a private audience with Al Di Napoli? Oh Only in my wildest dreams. All those nights spent role-playing in Mother's utility room. If only we'd known. I loved him in the Redeemer. Oh, Nigel, do your Al Di Napoli line. This is turban warfare, motherfucker. <laughs> It's uncanny! <laughs> oh dear. Poor Jock must think we're bad. Oh, I won't! Jock! Do you see that lorry? What the fuck's a lorry? Have a little faith! Anyone would think this was my first kidnapping. I hear that behind his charitable public face, he's remarkably right-wing. One can but hope. Liberal in the bedroom, conservative at the border, Mrs. Thornhill. <laughs> I... He's going into the car park! The car park! No worries, mate! What on earth will we feed the man? I hadn't even thought of that. He probably eats sushi or quinoa. Is that even how you say it? What if he wants meth? Oh, my giddy aunt! Everything okay there, Earl Crazy Cakes? My prostate has taken quite a beating. You have to lower the tone. Glad to see you on the proper side of the road, dear boy. Maybe I should have driven. Oh, I hope he likes us. This level of derangement, I'm impressed. Little by little. Is he going through the hospital? Oh, my lord! Hold on to your corsets! Uh... Seems rude not to follow him through the window. Such a thrill! Ah, uh, would you like me to escort your guest of honor to the trunk? Well, if you don't mind. Oh, come here, you! Come on! Come on! Let me meet your biggest fan! Fucking crazy! Oh, it's Get off me. Me. You're good to go! Ah, a true gentleman. This is so exciting! Nut jobs. And Trevor is the Trevor. Trevor is a Trevor is a what? Trevor uh, is a good guy. He's quite family. I got kid, ain't he, Floyd? That, 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 that's it, right. Yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's going to leave me. I mean, this is her place. And the fornicating? There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa. Whoa. Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam. He died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some girls laugh when they, when they look at it. Well, show me. Oh, no. Show me, no, boy! I, 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 I don't want to. No. Mine ain't nothing special, but this boy gets the job done, all right? Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Uh, yes. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? Oh, Jesus. Yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there to put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Run, we got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it.
Come on then, Floyd. What you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. Uh, you're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. Uh, sir, uh, I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever since. Boy, I got work work of sticking the mud. Uh, look, uh, sir, please, uh, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't quite describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? $236 billion worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. Have you noticed anything? Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Merriweather folks hanging around. Merriweather Security Consulting. Private army to the New World Order? My butt's gone The folks waging outsourced shadow wars in 20 countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil? That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter? Perfect. Can I get on board? No, no. They won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. Go park and get the dispatch. Here comes the soup. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. It don't matter what went in his mouth. It matters what came out. We got a waste spillage, and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Get in there. You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. You ever got helicopters coming in and out of here? You know, those big sky crane things that could pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. Shoot it down if they have to. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that's stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. I just said they have the water surface real covered. Okay. So that is the freighter I told you about. What do you think they got on it? We just stevedore them. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. Anything weird about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my curiosity. Over there, two o'clock. Looks like Forrest got on the wrong side of some Merriweather guys. You! You! We need two guys on the handler. A couple of containers and baby gotta be brought up to F. That ain't a question. Get on it. Now! Get up. We gotta do this. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just uh, Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. You'll be fine. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happened when he's neck deep in shit. They're so on to us. Those are the containers in Bay B. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay F. 
I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. You happy? Now I'll get the other one for you. Me, anyway. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. Nah, nah, nah. I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect! Oh, shoot! Be careful! If my work here is done, I'm going up the gantry. Time to admire the view. I've been waiting on a crane driver nearly an hour. I'm not permitted to drive cranes, buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out of here. This is on you. Okay, I'm sitting here. What do you want? First, you gotta line up the cabin over the container. There's some lights on the spreader that should help with alignment. Looks like you're in line. It's hooked up, so lift it high enough to clear that container stack and move it to the other end. We need to go to the other end, bay five. Keep going, keep going. the truck. Set it down gentle. Truck is clear to go. Signal man and crane driver working together. Now let's do the same thing again. Take us back up to the other end. Line up the second red container at the end.
You're done. Break time. How about this view, huh? I'm gonna take some photos for the kids. Trevor, come on. I can take you over to the warehouse. We can use the big rig. It's over on the other dock. So they've been guarding one of them dry docks. We can take a look at it, but no one's allowed around there. Normal rules don't apply to us, Floyd. We're going in. I don't know. The rules applied to me my whole life. I like rules. And look at you. You're a failure. You're in a loveless relationship. What do you mean? Loveless? I love Deborah. If she loved you, she'd be here, wouldn't she? But she's not. Uh, you know I'm insecure. You've got a dead-end job. What? Dead-end? No. Floyd, it's dead-end. Being a unionized longshoreman's one of the best-paying jobs in the country. You tell people around La Puerta that's what you do, they're liable to rob you. They're so jealous. No one's jealous of you, Floyd. They pity you. You're abused by that woman. You're abused by these slave drivers. I mean, I've never worked so hard in my life. Hey, 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 hey! You can't come through here. It's restricted access. No entiendo! Uh, no understando! Huh? Manifesto! Manifesto say deliver here! Mm. Hey, stop! Where the fuck do you think you're going? Back out! Back out! Back out! Hey, 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 got confused. Uh, God don't speak English. Uh, must have just read the manifesto. manifesto. He said, he said, he said no, he had a Trevor, these photos, you've really stumbled onto something. The ship, Merriweather. Yeah, 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 I know. Tell me about the ship. If we put a man with a gun on the bridge next to it and get a guy on board, I think we got a good chance of taking over. Way it looks to me, there's a container below deck. They're guarding it for the government, keeping it off the books. Serious military technology, most like. Yeah. Of course. I just found a manifest. They're testing something out at sea. It's gotta be that. Now, get back to work. The TPI conglomerate ain't thriving. There's only one man responsible. Of course, yeah. But I'll start pulling all the intel I can get on Merriweather at the same time. I, I got a file here somewhere.
of all things holy. I, I, I tried to stop it, but it just kept coming and coming. Oh, it's, they're there, Wade. Look, 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 there. Betty, you're just not cut out for honest work, all right? Did, did you get what you needed? Yeah, 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 more or less. Yeah, I just got to uh, figure out a place to plan this now. All right, this will do. That woman ain't even fine. Ain't no one understands why Floyd lets her use him so. Oh, that's uh, low self-esteem, Wade. We gotta build him back up. Now. And there, perfect. All right, so. Based on my observations, I'd say these Meriwether security cocksnots are sitting on something real valuable. I think they got two of these things, but we only need one. First one is on that freighter in a container below deck. They got guards all over that ship, so it's likely they're keeping it on ice. The air, land, and sea routes into the port will be locked down as soon as we make a noise at these X's here. Which means we have to blow up the ship and grab the thing underwater. Need a guy to plant the bombs, a guy to look out for him with a rifle, and a guy to grab the thing, whatever it is, underwater. That means stealing us a submarine, of course, but you can find us one of them, can't you? Huh? Now, the other one is off the coast being tested. They're running the operation from the dock where I last saw your cousin. We'll need a submarine for that, too, and probably a chopper, a big one. We go out there, look around underwater, locate it, Bring it back here and find out what it is. Here? To the Congo? Aye, so, what do you think? Container ship or whatever's offshore? It's gotta be the container, right? You and Floyd can help, and we'll bring along Michael and his unpaid intern. Okay, all right. What is that smell? Oh, we are going straight to the local union rep. Yep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duties. Human waste has seeped into his very pores, and I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever going to smell normal again. <laughs> you can't go to the union. You are union, all right, and you vouched for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him. No. Smell him. Uh, uh, Trevor, Trevor, uh, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. You damaged Deborah. Look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide, huh? If you're comfortable with what's happened to your cousin, then so be it, all right? But I would give him a bath and rinse him off. No! No bath! 